So we're on the west coast of the Cape and we're heading north because let's let, look, let's face it, we love to head north. West coast of Cape York, really good conditions, but we just heard some news from the outside world and it's not good, it's not something that we were expecting and had no idea was happening. This is a bit full on, but apparently in Brisbane, there has been a COVID outbreak and the Queensland, while we've been sitting out here on this boat for the last basically two weeks, we've been out of Brisbane, they've shut down all of Queensland, mask wearing, you've got to be mask wearing all over Queensland if you're within 1.5 metres, if you're not social distancing, all that sort of stuff is going on right as we speak. How full on is that? Like, we had no idea it was happening. I made a, a sat phone call back home, and next thing you know, it's a COVID lockdown. Wow. We've got three more days before we can go into the community, so we're gonna do what the authorities say, and we're gonna isolate for those three days. So we're gonna go and explore this river, and then three days later, we'll hook up with the community, and that's when we'll start looking at what sort of fuel we're gonna need and things like that. A true all for adventure uh, style, we're going to do isolation the way we know best. Stay out in the bush. That's it. I don't hold You pretty much just want it touching. Just touching? Yeah, yeah, just touching. <laughs> Safety first. Hold my gum. Woohoo! <laughs> Well, that's going to be us for the next few days up there. We're going to set up camp, mate. What do you reckon? Hell yeah. Quad bike, tinny, yeah. explore, catch fish. That's what I reckon. This is, this is a pretty spectac uh, spectacular river, this one. Apparently there's a lot of rock bars and you, we can follow this river system, like I mean, so far up, right up into the fresh. There's little running creeks and fresh water and all sorts of things going on. And this one is quite in the middle from civilization. Yes. Now it's been a massive day travelling up the coast, we knocked a few k's over, uh, we're going to set up our gear here, oh, it's a cool little spot, we're going to fuel everything up, get everything ready and then we're going to head off in the morning. I'm excited to explore this river. Bloody beautiful, look at that. The monster from the deep! Cheers, mate. Buddy. The birdies know exactly where the fish are. So we're going to have to do some hunting, mate. Hunting for the fishers. They ain't going to come, come to us easily. They're going to need some work. Look at them stingrays chasing that bait, Tom. The old man stinger. Huge. Mate, there's, there's a hell of a lot of bird life and fish life going on around here. The stingrays and the pelicans, they're all catching fish. He did. He did so. But <laughs> we don't seem to be catching many. Oh, what a hook. I got the bottom of a stingray. Oh, got him. Oh, dropped him. A little salmon, I think. Oh, got him now. Yeah. Yep. See what's chasing those bait fish. Little queenies. Oh, Little dropped him. Bottom? Yeah, I'm the bottom. Yep. But anyway, we'll, uh, we'll keep heading up the river, see what we can find. That's the problem with places like this. It takes a little bit of time to find where the fish are. 